Morning, North Carolina homeowners are railing against a proposal to raise insurance rates statewide. Insurance companies are asking for an average increase of 42% statewide. And if you own a home along the coast, you'd see a 99% increase. The state is asking for feedback on the plan. And as Faith Alford explains, there was no shortage of that. Mary and Alex, that's right. In fact, the Department of Insurance held a public hearing about the possible hike in Raleigh on Monday. This was not our plan in retirement. People like Nancy Nestor travel from across the state and join online to voice their concerns. She moved to Wake Forest from Chicago thinking it would be cheaper, but she came out of retirement after a waterfall of extra expenses. Everything's escalating to the point where it you can't make ends meet on the retirement income alone. So yeah, I actually drive for Lyft. Now, I have driven for the last 10 months as extra income. People who live along the North Carolina coast would see the biggest increase in their insurance rates, 99% if the request is granted. Cheryl Hunter lives in Surf City. She's worried she'll have to find a new place to live. I know that if it raises like that, that I, I'm going to have to leave what I thought was going to be my forever home. The department says the rate hike is a balancing act of making sure consumers pay a fair amount and that companies continue doing business here. What we do not want to happen is what is happening in some other states, and I'm thinking of Florida comes to mind, where insurance companies are leaving the state and consumers don't have choices. You have until February 2nd to weigh in on the proposal by mail. Already 9,000 comments have been sent in by email. Now we'll have the information on our website about how you can have your opinion heard on WBTV.com. In Charlotte, Faith Alford, WBTV on your side.